Hey everyone, it's your favorite monkey and welcome, welcome, welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. Now, last episode we did go ahead and clear out the all foods over there uh, with Maelstrom and well that's what happened last episode. Then we encountered that bug where Jackie was stuck between the peoples or some dude or whatnot. So I reloaded the game, same thing happened, then I reloaded way back. And I somehow managed to help out the Maelstroms. Instead of defeating them, we are now buddies. So that is now a thing. Plus, we got some cool new gear and whatnot. Um, this is an epic thing for the heads. What do you call it? I don't know. The, the, the thing here. <laughs> I don't know why is our eyes so dark. We had got a new um, assault rifle as well same time. Uh, but no new pistol. But there is a specific pistol I'm after. I know exactly where to get it um but it's just that's down the storyline right now talking about storyline let's go ahead uh we need to go and meet lizzie between 6 a 6 p.m and 6 a.m right now it's currently 10 38 so it is about time we go there um yeah let's go to lizzie's bar just quick travel right to the exact spot and uh, we'll see what she has to say. I can't remember this part, really. Um, but I'm pretty sure it will go very smoothly. Okay, where the hell are we? Huh. What's up, ma'am? How you doing? Why can't I remember this part? I don't know. Um, let's run this way and see where we can so cut through here. And... I sort of remember this now. Hey! It's, it's me! Hey, it's you! The guy who... You know. Guy with the smoking crotch. That's one way to put it. Anyway, just calling to say I transferred the funds. Thanks. Oh, no, thank you! It worked for you, I... No problem. Go get him, tiger. <laughs> Go get him, Tiger. Oh, uh, yes. All right. So here we are at Lizzie's bar. Let's go ahead and... Hey there, dollface. What's up? Interest you in a preem, BD? Um... Uh, I don't what know. Do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers. No washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch, it's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's sight. Think you can handle it? Bespoke? Damn, that sounds promising. I get it, I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green deal. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. But clearly it Have is. Fun, doll. Thanks. Welcome to Lizzie's. Doll. Doll. My, what a sweet little face you have. And yours ain't. Let's move along. And we're going to Lizzie's bar, people. Just one thing. Um, very suggestive themes here. I'm just putting it out there. Okay. You. Mateo. Hey. Get you something. Um... Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh huh. So. <laughs> so uh huh. Evelyn. Club's big. Gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Uh, hi. Evelyn Parker. 
Yes, why the long pauses? I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Sense on. Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? Uh, I like to I'm know drunk. everything about the people <laughs> I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm hmm. Hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. All right, thanks, bud. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. Just one question. Look how big those glasses are, and you drink that amount of tequila? I think the future so, is really... Like, there's a lot of drunk, drunk people. Why don't you just tell me the yeah. truth? Yeah. Sit there. All right, let's get to business, shall we? What's up, lady? Hey, let's smoke in here. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Mm-hmm. No idea if Dex exaggerates. A little, a lot. You got me. Just started working with him, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Then there's the other kind. Dex's kind. What's that supposed to mean? Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic, secure your soul trinket. I don't think you can zoom in. I actually soul. forgot about that. We're tangling with Arasaka. <gasps> Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Nope. Classy Corp hotels? Mm, yeah, no. How to my price range? Hmm. Well, the decor's to die for, as you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What, so Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Tell me. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Okay. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay. Okay. What's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got Eek. something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? What Jacking you off to like in those boxes? Else? Look, that's no. Uh, no, 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 it can I be a very useful it. tool. So many people have not been talking. No. Analyzing no. details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. 
You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. You mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? No, not at all. Let's see this brain dance. Why, why are we just help. like standing here She's talking? Too. Besides, we go back uh, years. Uh, v, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. I always helped out. I trust her. Okay. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Aha! I knew there was something. I never checked this place before. Hello. Hey, there you are. This is V. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy, best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. The barf. Hey, Judy. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside? What the hell? Look, Why can't I move in here? Around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dead. Ever taken a dip before? Look, I'm no beady virgin, but the raw stuff, uncharted territory. Relax, I'll explain everything. It's less complicated than it sounds. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. All right. Anything I can loot? No. I like how the chair looks like. We're all wrinkled, destroyed. Just a quick warning here, people. Um, if you have any, if you're prone to seizures and whatnot, I would suggest not look at this part because they are, there's flashing lights and whatnot. I'm just giving you guys a heads up right now, okay? You, it's, it's not my fault. I gave you a warning. All right, Lizzie, check me in. Got to create your sensory profile first. What? Why? Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I going to have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. I need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we... Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Size won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Okay. Last chance, people. If you're prone to seizures because of lights, look away now or stop the video. Go do something else. This is your last warning. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, one. Okay, it wasn't that bad, but usually it flashes left to right Plan and simple. then. Do nothing yeah. odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. 
They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Down, everybody! On the ground! I wanna see you kissing the flooring! Money! Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Ah! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. A flash of... Intense shock. I can still feel it. I, I remember. Fuck. That last second. Could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. I wouldn't mind testing one of these BDs. See how it is. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Full cam control in analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plant simple. Okay, so you can use play and pause or the space bar to play and pause. We're just basically, we were this dude. Now we're experiencing like editing mode. We can see around us like uh, we are, we're not controlling them. We're just following them and we can use different layers of like um, analyzing heat and audio, I think was the other one. And it's just basically whatever this person around them picked up his sensors his uh, ears eyes nose whatever picked up this is what we are experiencing right now Nothing odd. don't get creative you go in snatch the cash get out and we sell the bd to those psycho freaks from the studio got it got it dream as hell right well that's not all you can speed things up or rewind whatever you like give it a try rewind roll it back to the top Shut up, get up. All good, neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. If you're wondering how we're doing this, key and E, key is to roll backwards, back in time, and E is to move forwards in time. Creative. You go in, snatch the cash. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. And we're gonna hold R to reset completely or restart the uh, BD. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Okay, so now we have to scroll. That's simple. Do when this dude the gives this dude the weapon. weapon. Studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. That's why I think we get under the Okay, there it right is. Here. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, so we're gonna press shift and we're gonna go to audio. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay, so we got two indicated by the circles on the left hand and right hand side so let's go with this one first just looking at it okay fuck on you ah, little shitheads go restock i'll take the register how about you suck a bag of dicks hey eh? so any thoughts believable 
Seriously, like it was happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Okay, I just want to listen to this. I forgot about this one. Go I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, okay? okay? We have a deal today on two flavors. Cody and yeah. Serpent. Everybody! Alright. So let's switch Sometimes over to the visual. Extra layers in the raw. Stuff the rollers fiberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. On the ground! You wanna see you kissing the flooring? Money! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Moving on. A little bit more. See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. Okay, I just want to do something real quick. Oh, it must be the source. The uh, gun source. Uh, let's go back to here. Right here. His own chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Yep, I think that is pretty cool. That's weird. I think I'm seeing a face. Don't know what that is. Okay. And let's go ahead and exit this. We're almost done with the uh, whole brain dance thing. With this mission. Yeah, it's impressive, right? Too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Indeed. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? I don't know. I... Ugh, let's take a break. I still feel like that kid when... <sighs> yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Go ahead. Just need T-Buck to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Runner for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why, cause you say so? Please, Judy. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Thank you. Hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Konpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Konpeki? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? <sighs> Unimportant, Bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? I'm millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. All right, here we go. 
Sorry this is taking a little bit longer than is expected, but it's vital. This is vital, vital things. You look like a cut of fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn, she... I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said, no. They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to... Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Okay. Uh, switching on. You know what? The, the um... Quest is asking us to watch the whole thing from Evelyn's point of view. I think we're not going to do that. I want to get this done as quickly as possible. So, uh, let us get into editing mode. And let's go ahead and scan the security in the area. Uh, there is, I think, motion sensor camera. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Okay, let's go back. Where is over there? Yeah, you? What the heck? Whatever you are. There? Alarm firmware is fresh, but. Saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Okay, that is that. Um, let's move on. They'll have my head for this. There we go. Uh, let's switch to this. Marsh for good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling, servers, gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. And you? I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's involved. a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality, stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists, of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no, provide them. In Heard that? Relic docs gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. All right. Uh that has been scanned. There was something else. Um, some must no. relic. Oh. Fight them. Enough. Sorry to make to make demands of me. Oh, got in the can. Left. Step was. Ah, there we go. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. All right. Can't get around them ourselves. Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Or we can just shoot them. Pretty fun, lad. There was, there's something this girl is seeing. I can't figure out what. Sam, I'd love for you to hear from 
What is it? What are you seeing? What what are you sensing? Ah, I'm Candy screwed. left. Steph was pretty woman last night. Good one. Nice one. Hey, moving no on. Be right back. Get there. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Yeah, this is the weapon I was talking about earlier. Um, which I want to grab. Okay, and here we go. Come on, let me do the thing. Manual details a special temp controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, Chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip. Alright. There is something I wanted to do. Where? What are you seeing? Is it that? That's not that. What? No, I don't see what she's seeing. Maybe I'm blind. I don't know. And there's another noise somewhere. May never have existed. We oh. have not seen eye to eye. Okay. Let's go ahead and scan things. Oh, Donaghy's. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. You really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. For the past 20 years. Alright, scanning, scanning. Last time. Bedroom. Nice. I got For the perfect thing. Ah, uh, you'll like this. That's ooh, over here, maybe. Air conditioning, standard model for hotels of this caliber. Temp matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Temp fluctuations, risk of damage. Wait. We skipped too far ahead. Ooh. Okay. I said, you'll have my head for this. There. What are you seeing? We shall perish for a good cause. What makes a good cause? Um. Oh, I don't know. I what, what are you looking at? Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Your Nobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. All right, so we got it. Here we go. So it's over there. But I just want to know what the hell is she seeing? Like, what's the heat? What's that? You know what? We're done. We're done. I can't. I cannot take any more. Get everything you need? Yep. That'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Yes, yes, I know. Eat the paper and... Whatever. Whatever you do, you know what the spies do, like to tear up the paper and eat it. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. 
portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. We needed that recording, Judy. BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Thanks. Thank you very much. Uh, do you do dental? I, I I don't know. Let's walk. Yeah, uh, well, I was already out of the door, and you're just standing there looking at me, undressing me with your eyes. Well, what do you think? So, what now? V. Do this job for me. I mean, me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. Stupid crosshair. No middlemen. No decks. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay. For sure. I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. All right. Okay, so... We've... No, don't cry. You got this, doll. Mm-hmm, sure. How are things looking, sure. Miss V? See you soon. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Miss V. Going in or staying out? Uh, what does it look like? <laughs> Jeez. Worst bodyguard ever. Okay. I'm gonna... Man, this place is dirty. Cleaner than Johannesburg, though. Anyways, um, I'm gonna end off the episode here. Thank you so much for watching is Cyberpunk with me, or staying, staying tuned or whatnot. Uh, we will pick this up on the next episode. And, uh, yeah. Sorry we hit... The, it took so long, but at least we got where we needed to be. Anyways, people, thank you so much. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.